Good morning, Mohawks. This is Carmen and Ella with your Mohawk News Flash. Today is a Football Fact Friday, February 5th, 2021. The reason we are calling it Football Friday is because the Super Bowl is this Sunday between Kansas City Chefs, Chiefs, and Tampa Bay what is Buccaneers. Buccaneers. It's it is the single most popular sporting event in the United States. The more with the more people watching the Super Bowl game each year than any other TV show. Any more and more food is consumed in the United States on Super Bowl Sunday than any other day except Thanksgiving. The Pittsburgh Steelers Steelers have won the most Super Bowls with six wins. Two teams, the San Francisco 49ers and the Dallas Cowboys have won five Super Bowls. The most points ever scored by a team in the Super Bowl is 55 by the San Francisco 49ers. The fewest points ever was three by the Miami Dolphins. And can you believe one thirty second com commercial aired during the Super Bowl cost at least Two, two million eight hundred thousand. Plus, the trophy is created by Tiffany and a company, and company, and costs twenty five thousand. Today for lunch we are having Big Daddy's Pizza, sweet corn, and fresh apples. School announcements, kids. If you get breakfast in the morning and you don't open it, please give it to your teacher. Do not throw it in the trash. Next week, student counseling succograms. You will purchase these in your class and they will be passed out Thursday, February 11th. Also, Thursday, February 11th will be our Valentine's Day parties at school. Next Friday, February 12th, there will be no school because of the teacher's professional day. Don't forget to sign up for the Children's with Hair Loss on February 16th through 19th. There will be a flyer sent home next week with all the information. Their ha the hair cutting will be here at school and will take place the week of March 1st. Today's joke of the day, which school supply is king of the class? I don't the, know. The ruler. <laughs> um, Carmen, why did the boy want to bring a ladder to school? I don't know. Why did he? He wanted to go to high school. <laughs> Today's weather will be partly cloudy with a high of 29. Tonight, partly cloudy, low of 21. Today's birthdays are Cooper Burgess, Lila Cecil, Alex Badger, Emmy Stacy. This week's we have Josie Huffman, Isaac Moos, Muniz, Jimmy, Jeremy Gibbs, Bryson Clark, and Malachi Craig. And this weekend we have a staff birthday, Miss Gooseman. Happy birthday. After announcements, please walk to the office to get your birthday pencil. Also, remember to tell the kind cooks in the cafeteria that it is your birthday and they will give you a birthday cookie. Now let's stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Next up is our Super Bowl video brought to you by Wilson, which is a company right here in Ada, Ohio. How Wilson makes official NFL Super Bowl footballs. It's made in the United States. It's a great opportunity for us here in Ada to make a football. I love knowing that it makes everybody smile when they're watching the game.
and I'm very proud of what I do here. This is like a family. One minute you love each other, and the next minute you <laughs> want to kill each other. <laughs> it's a family, and that's, that's awesome to come to work with your family. So start to finish, uh, we'll, we purchase our leather hides from Horween Leather in Chicago. Once we have the hides here, uh, depending on what balls we're making, we, we'll pick that die and we'll actually clicker cut uh, every panel uh, in stacks of four. After it's cut down, then they'll go through and they'll stamp the ball with whatever design is going to go on it. There, and that's where we start to, to actually control the, the ball weight. And then they split the leather to get a, rid of the little bit of excess material, kind of get some weight off of the ball. Then they sew a lining onto the leather that's going to help the leather hold its shape. And then it'll go onto a sewer, so it could go to me if it's a game ball, or it could go to one of our other sewers that operate our piercing machines. We will sew the four panels together. Um, it's sewed inside out, that way you don't see any of the seams. From there it goes onto a turner. This is probably the most difficult job, uh, is physically turning all that material right side out. Uh, and the reason we do that is we, we want to hide the seams uh, and then smooth them off. So after they do that, it comes over back over to the Puritan sewers and then they sew the football together. From there, it goes to the lacers. They'll insert the bladder in the ball. That's what's going to hold all the air. And then we're going to do final mold for shape. So it goes into a mold, we, we apply pressure to the bladder, which pushes the seams out, smooths the ball out, and finishes it and gives it its final shape uh, for uh, small and large circumference. And then it goes to inspection, and then we pack the football and it goes to the customer. That was neat. That was awesome. That's hard to do, by the way. <laughs> Did you is, is, this, is, this a, is this a test to know if I know how to make a football or not? Wow, that was a good one. Well, I actually grew up just 10 minutes away, so the fact that this is so close to my hometown, there's just so much pride that goes into it, that little Ada, Ohio, that something as important as the Super Bowl, you know, we're making balls for the game right here in Ada, Ohio. It's pretty special. Pride, passion, the, the family, the teamwork that we have here is amazing. Um, I know everybody in the building, right? I know their families and their kids and what sports they play, and we can have those conversations, but. That's bringing it back to Ada, but that's all basically America. This is small town America. It's the family. People care about each other. When something tragic goes on in your life, we're there. Every one of us is there for each other, and that makes the difference.